Hey guys, we're gonna do a review over the 2022 Volkswagen Golf GTI SE. Let's get right to it. So we're gonna be getting a two liter, four cylinder turbocharged engine that's actually gonna be producing 241 horsepower, 273 pound feet of torque. You're also going to be getting 25 miles per gallon in the city, 34 on the highway. And just with this really slick looking paint color, this is the gun metallic paint color or metallic paint color, just looks really nice. In addition to that, you're gonna be getting these 18 inch alloy wheels, the red calipers, going to the side keyless entry for both the driver and the passenger. And on the back of this vehicle, you're gonna get dual exhaust, looking really nice. Just really love the badges and so on and so forth. You just flick this up right over here. There you have it. Open the back of the trunk. What you're gonna be getting in the trunk are rubber floor mats with the GTI symbol that's actually in the rubber. So that is actually a really cool aesthetic look with the peep cover, really nice for people who are wanting to keep their belongings safe and sound. In addition to that, let's look at the inside of the rear. What you're gonna be getting is rear ventilation, two USB-C ports, cup holders in the back, and the seats back here are cloth. So you're gonna be getting that classic Volkswagen look. Going to the side over here, you're going to be getting adjustable seating, power, and manual. So that's really nice. And you're going to be getting that manual part over there for the classic driver's seat look. You're also going to be getting bucket seating. So that is actually one of the best features that this vehicle does have is the bucket seating. And another feature I wanted to point out that goes with the bucket seats are these little slots that you can actually put your phone in. So this is a really cool feature if you want to put your phone, any electronics, and just storm right over there, that is going to be there just for you. Let's go to the interior on the driver's side. As you can see, we got these little tiny lights that are on each one of the handles, giving it a better look. Power windows for all of the windows. Also power and adjustable seating. Same goes for the other side as we saw before. Tilt and telescopic wheel right over here. Let's tilt that, boom, looks really good. And in this specific model that we have on the lot, we actually have someone who put the R badge over here on the stick. This is a six speed automatic manual transmission. So that's really, really nice. Um, with that, they're gonna get tons of features, a heated steering wheel that's going to be having all these haptic buttons right over here that can navigate the digital cluster system over here that continues to have tons of safety. I love how much Volkswagen has put into their safety systems over here. You're also gonna be getting this Harmony Kardon sound system that comes with a subwoofer. Really, really nice. Over here, you're gonna be getting a wireless charging pad, start engine button right over here. You're gonna get these really fancy cup holders. Really cool, really like that and you're gonna be getting the center console as well. Going up here to the infotainment display, let's click on the assist systems. So let's just push on that. What you're gonna be getting is adaptive cruise control, lane keeping system, lane change system, dynamic road sign display, and front assist. So really nice. Let's go to the driving modes. What you're gonna be getting is eco comfort sport, really good. Let's press this menu, showing the back of the vehicle. Again, really good. Climate system, I love the way that they're doing their climate systems now. You're gonna be having the heated seats for both the driver and the passenger. Not only that, but you'll have all the classic functions right over here. You can just press that and you can actually power on the AC. So yeah, you can use it up there, really, really good. And if you just wanna click that button right over here, we have tons of different features that are on this. You can go to the vehicle button right over here, go through the driving data. You can go through the messages right over here. I'm pretty sure that this one is going to be getting an oil change soon by our service department. Yep, right over there. So that is actually fantastic that it notifies you of those things. And that will be changed very, very soon. Let's press the vehicle button right over here. We can go to the mirrors. We can go to like all these different types of things that are very good for this vehicle. So if we wanna to go to tires, for example, this is gonna be going through the TPMS system, kind of the speed warnings if you have winter tires, exterior lights, you can keep the durations if you want to basically have those daytime running lights as well. You can go right over here to the headlights. So that's really good. And yeah, just really, really good vehicle. Absolutely love it. Let's go to the top over here. You get garage door openers and a Bluetooth button right over here underneath the rear view mirror. And you're going to be getting these touch sensitive lights with this sunroof. And it's actually a really decent sized sunroof. So let's just slide our finger right over there and let's open that up. Really, really classy, really slick. Love how big these Volkswagen sunroofs actually are. But yeah, 
Basically, this is the 2022 Volkswagen Golf GTI SE. If you're wanting to learn more about this vehicle, you can actually go to our website, or if you're wanting to just learn about this vehicle in general, you can go to Edmunds and any type of site and just look at the specs. It's really, really cool. And something that I want to point out before we go, ambient lighting. Yep, there we have it, we have ambient lighting. And we can go through that in a couple of our shorts. If you want to see the tutorials, go on down to the playlist that we're going to be showing very, very soon.